Hey everyone, this is Brian Manning and I'm going to show you how to add a pay now or a pay your bill button or a link to your WordPress website. This is part of an ongoing series of videos on adding payments to your website because there's definitely not just one way to do this. So you're going to get A to Z steps right here in this video and I'm going to go through everything right now. We'll get into the website editor, we'll create the button and enter the link so that your customer can click on it to pay you. Furthermore, you should also have a button or a link that's in installed on your website. The tools that are needed for this are very simply a Card Connect merchant account because that's the hosted payment page that we're going to be dealing with and a WordPress website that's already set up and configured. The first step is to request the hosted payment page to be activated. You can do this by contacting your Card Connect representative and if you're not sure how to do that or you don't have one, check the links in the description for help. Once you have requested the hosted payment page, you'll receive an email and it'll look something similar to this. This will be unique to your specific merchant ID number. So again, this has to be requested and activated through Card Connect because they manage this page for you. Once the email comes, it gives you two options to use the hosted payment page. And here's a sample of those two formats shown right here live on this web page. And this page will be linked up in the description so you can click on these buttons and actually see them live. The first is a simple hyperlink to take and add to an image button or add as a hyperlink text option. And the second option option is HTML code that's placed into a WordPress editor, which automatically generates this pay now button. Both of these options take you to the same exact payment page. It's just a matter of whether you want to use the HTML code or the link, and I'll give you practical applications for both in just a minute. The hosted payment page that we're setting up has the following structure. You have your website, which in this case is built with WordPress. Then you have the hosted payment page, which is on Card Connect's secure servers. When you install a button or a link on your website and your customer clicks on it, they leave your website and they're redirected over to the hosted payment page. So they do actually leave your website, but the security is handled and managed by Card Connect for the hosted payment page. So let's build a page in WordPress and install a button, a link, and the embed code to show you how this works. If you have a web development company that you work with either internally or somebody that you've hired, you can simply give them these links and this HTML code that I'm going to go through with you and they can configure all of this for you. But to show you how easy and simple this is, just come into the WordPress dashboard and select pages. So this is inside of the dashboard of the WordPress website for your company. Come down to the pages section and select add new and name your page and then come over and save the draft. If you click preview here, you can see that the page has already been created, but nothing exists on the page yet. So to add the payment button, you'll need a pay now image of a button. With some WordPress themes, there are button generators and there are even some plugins that will allow you to create a button. But since there's so many variables to button design and page design for that matter, I'm just gonna show you how to install an image and make that image, in this case, a button clickable so you can install the payment page link for your hosted payment page. So on your WordPress page, come down to the text editor, which is right here. This is where you'll type in the text on the page and we'll also insert the image button. So I'll just type some text in here and then I'll come into the add media button and click on it and find the pay now image and insert it into the editor. If you haven't uploaded or you don't have a pay now button yet, you can just upload it by dragging right into this interface right here. So there's my text and my button. Now we simply take the hosted payment page link that Card Connect emailed us and you copy it to your clipboard and then come back to the image and click on it so that it's highlighted. Then come up to this figure eight look link, click on it and paste your link right in here and click enter. Then come up and save the page and click preview. Once you're ready to publish the page, just click on publish and your new button and your new page is live and ready to go on your website. In the same way that we just attached the hosted payment page to the button, we can attach it to the hyperlink by simply highlighting the text that we want as a link and clicking on the hyperlink button again and pasting the hosted payment page link right in here. The second option is the embed option. Within WordPress, you have a visual editor, which is what you 
see right now and where we've been working. And you have a text tab, which is for HTML code. You can see the code right here. If I click on this, you can see this code from my previous images and the text. And let's say I want to start clean. So I'll just highlight everything clear out of my editor. So I have a blank slate. Then I just need to grab the HTML code from the email that Card Connect sent and paste it as is. And that's it. If I click back to the visual editor, you can see the button right here. And once I click update on this WordPress page, the new button is going to be live. One of the most common ways to use the hosted payment page is for buy now buttons just like this that we've gone over in this video. Remember, this page is a standalone payment page. So if you want to email this link to your customers along with an invoice, for example, you could easily do that. This page stands independent of your website. So just to be clear, between these two options, you have a simple link that you can put on a button or an image, or you can make it part of a hyperlink within text of your WordPress website page. And the second option is HTML code that you just take and place into the editor, and it is what it is. It's exactly as you see right here, and there is no adjustments or design changes that you can make to this page. What you see is what you get here. So for more card point tutorials and merchant account trainings, as well as payment page tutorials, just like this one, be sure to click on that subscribe button because I will be covering other payment page options that allow you to further customize the look and design and feel of your website. When you subscribe, you get notifications when future videos are posted. Share this video with your friends, comment below if you have any questions and I'm Brian Manning and thanks for watching.